Yo pienso para ya para que para lo que para jor sakane ka channel jungi simple story. Let's see kane ka kubor kan pen kendi tia ya ki pai ba ka jela mekhaya. Haba uni utkar nako hati naka lailak tengka. U kalalong u kropati haki kendi penai. Naka jing kai be an ya u deyong na mekhaya sya Bangladesh. Kat kum ka kubor bala belai da ka DY 365 u barwan Sony alias Bama Uba siyong basa aku hati Ula keu kensan ga jing don jing em jong u Naka lai lak tengka haus nam arah jarak hat nreu Syaka palat sepak kelur mentah Kat kum ga neka kubor ga yadho ba u neu breu Udon ga jing yadai ka baya janpa Bat u jim sang ma Uba si para bat u konrat sang ma Uba day u menteri yang ba ka Mekhalaya Locals of Mekhalaya deprive Lakpati becomes Karolpati in months in Mekhalaya Magic lamp is in the hands of an outsider. He is Balwan Soni alias Bhama. Feels like the man Balwan Soni alias Bhama has found the Aladdin's Chirag or Aladdin's lamp. From a few lakhs of rupees in 2016 to a karorpati from just 3 lakh rupees to over 100 crores in just 3 years. This man's fortune changed in just a few months. Here is proof of how the revenue jumped over 400 times. Jayama Coal Private Limited, a firm based in Guwahati, has been used by Bhama as the front. The director of the firm is Bhama's son, Yodhishtra Bhama, and the chartered accountant of the company is none other but Bahama's wife. The firm has been forging the bills and undervaluing the tax invoices and transporting coal from Meghalaya to Bangladesh through Gaswapara Custom Station through the Bagmara area. It is alleged that Bahama's family has close ties with James Sangma brother of Conrad Sangma. Let us take a look at the sprawling house of Bhama. This huge property is still under construction. Bhama is also known to own a fleet of SUVs and luxury cars. He is not a native of Meghalaya. He is a resident of Guwahati. But when it comes to illegal coal transportation from Meghalaya, Bhama seems to be ruling the roost. It will not be wrong to say that Balwan Solni, alias Bhama, has the entire illegal coal transportation business of Meghalaya in his pocket. Few months back, Balwan Solni was arrested by Assam police on the basis of an FIR filed by the Assam Tax Department regarding pilferage of 40 crore rupees. Despite being behind bars, Balwan Soni continued as the kingpin of illegal transportation of Meghalaya coal. There is no fresh mining of coal in Meghalaya, so where is all these coal coming from? Balwan Soni's transshipments of coal continue to cross the borders violating FEMA and FERA. Money laundering has been another part of the entire illegal coal trade that this person has been doing for some time now. Why no action taken? Whose hand is behind Balwan Soni? The dynamic, forward-looking Meghalaya Chief Minister Conrad Sangma seems unaware of the illegal activities. Letters have been written to the Chief Secretary of Meghalaya citing details about what J. Markol Private Limited is doing, how it is flouting norms, how it is illegally transporting coal to Bangladesh from South Garo Hills. But the questions remain. Why is the Mining and Geology Department of Meghalaya mum? How long will the people of Meghalaya continue to be deprived? What is the secret behind 
the 100 crore turnover in just three years of Balun Sony.